Boom! So what do you guys think about that? We finally got past that part, and I would like to thank you so much for everybody who left comments about how to do that part. It actually, I, I tried for over an hour trying to get that part to work. And we are finally past it, and we can finally move on with the next part of this game. So we're now in the monkey's cage. So I gotta find the monkey. There we go. So they're not gonna talk, it's not gonna talk to us when we're in our deco form initially. Okay, so transform. Now talk to the monkey. And when he makes a noise, I know I did the right thing. So he's gonna ask us to try to let him out with our sword. But if you do, try to just try to do anything that it doesn't work. And you actually can't do anything, so he gives up in despair. But, if we get our ocarina out... Transform back into a Deku. Now he's really happy! Cause that's the instrument he recognized that the Deku Princess had opening the temple. So again, thank you so much for everybody who commented and helped out on my Discord channel to help me pass that last part there. I'm glad I was able to make that the beginning of this video. And actually with all your help and everything with the music and knowing where to turn and where to put the guards and torches, that actually made it super easy, so... I'm glad I have such a community to be able to help out, and definitely that is going to be able to help me pass this game. Um, definitely, because Ocarina of Time, I played through several times. Oh, I gotta pay attention here. There we go. Um, I played through several times um, before I actually played it through, but I have not played through this game once before, so your guys' input is great. So, he's not gonna teach us a song, but he says we gotta be very quiet. So I like how he's like being quiet, but then we play our pipes full blast. Oops. Let's try that again. Oh. There we go. Yeah, and we just blast our pipes out. <laughs> so, way to be discreet, Link. And this is the Song of Awakening. We use it for several things throughout this game. Yay! I never had to do this part again! Uh oh. So because he heard us learning the song that the princess knew, now he thinks that that is proof that the monkey did something wrong. So go ahead and punish him. Bye bye monkey. So if you actually go back into the throne room after being thrown out, you can actually see the punishment is they're dumping him in boiling water or fluid. And of course we get thrown out. Alright, so now what we need to do is go to the temple. And we we'll start by going this way because we're heading towards Woodfall. Alright, so we have to do the lily pads again. Oh, I wanted to stop back there, I think. Yeah, I tried. There we go. 
All right, so this is a path that little island that's off to the right, and there's a Deku flow around here we gotta find. Let's not do that. Okay, we found it. So this should just be simple. Fly up this way. Or not. There we go. Alright, so now we're in this area above where the Deku Palace entrance, entrance is. Now, there's this enemy out here I actually really don't like. Because I actually have a great fear of stinging insects. So, yeah, these things creep me out. See if that other one will come over here so I can take care of him. Yep. Oh, I think he's too far away. Yep. Come here, booger. There we go, we finally got him. Alright, so we don't have to worry about those. So now I have to find a Deku flower. Oh, without falling off. Got it. Alright, so now what we want to do is use the sound of the torches over there and the waterfall to navigate where we want to go. And for the first one, I want them kind of off, both off to my forward and left. There we go. Okay, now we gotta find the flower here. Oh, there it was. Oh, got it. All right. So for this one, now I wanna kinda of shoot towards the, uh, the torches on my left and the waterfall a little to my right. Okay, we got that one. Barely. <laughs> okay, so find the next flower. There it was. Okay. So these ones are easier depth because we have a lot more noise to go off of. Okay, this one I want the torch basically behind me and the waterfall to my forward left. There we go. Okay, now this is a bigger platform I think I have to get around. It's kind of an odd platform I'm trying to find the flower on. It seems like there's something in the middle that's kind of blocking me. Oh, there it was. I thought. There it is. Okay, this is the last one. Now we gotta fly and basically land near the eagle. Or the owl, I should say. Oh, and by the way, 
Oh, that was too far right. Because I heard tail or tattle fly off to the left. Still not far enough left. Now we went too far left. I think I let go too early. There we go. And it's the owl again. Oh no. Luckily he doesn't show up as much in this game. And you don't have to wait for his response. He just talks to you. He actually teaches you something quite clever this time. And it's something I've actually been waiting for for a very long time. And that's the ability to be able to warp. And that's going to help me navigate areas a lot quicker and a lot better. So I've been waiting for this for a very long time. Okay, can you just go away now? Thank you. Okay, now we want to read this tablet. And let's see if I can remember the keys to this one. A? Nope. I think it's down, left, up. Yep. Has a cute little tune, but has so much power. I think it's the Song of Soaring is what we just learned there. It's this game's version of transporting. And that ego statue that I... Owl statue, I'm sorry. That I hit in the... One of my previous videos in the middle of Clocktown. That's what those are for. And in the beginning of Southern Swamp. Alright, so now we gotta find a flower on here. Without jumping off. <clears throat> Alrighty. And I think we want to kind of edge. Hey, we want to cross the waterfall, so kind of aim to its right side with the torches behind us. There we go. Oh. Okay, 
And walk the right way. Not that way. And now we are entering what is called Woodfall. So hey everybody, it's Mega T Garrett again. Um, I know this is in the middle of a video, but I actually had to come back and re-record this part. And the reason is a couple things. One, um, when the night ends and it goes to the next day, my I was losing my graphics because I think it does some kind of effect where the screen kind of shrinks into the distance as the new day starts, and that was killing my graphics. The other reason was is when it becomes daytime, it actually regenerates the enemies that I'd already killed, and I couldn't figure out where I was going. So I'm re-recording this. The first part was recorded before Christmas and before I got sick. So I <clears throat> I've been sick and I apologize for my voice. And now it is after Christmas, so I hope you had an excellent holiday. But we're just going to finish up this last part. And the first thing I'm going to do is actually turn it to daytime so we don't have to worry about that. Just by speeding time forward. And this part's not hard. It just um, is a little... I don't know if I'm actually navigating through this part in the best efficient way. You'll have to let me know that. But we're just going to go through here and I'll show you how I do this. So, save state. And to the right. So that hip blue, I think, is the enemy is called. I want to basically forward and a little to my left before I start trying to find the lily pad. Nope. Way to the left. That was by accident. Found it. Okay. Now I gotta find the bridge that the hip blue is bouncing up and down on. Or not bouncing, but walking. Okay. Now, since this is such a very thin bridge, I have to make a lot of save states along this part. So, walk a little bit. Save. Walk a little bit. Kill a hip blue. Sorry about the lagging there with the bubble. I sure hope that isn't a problem during when we actually get like the bow and arrow and other things like that. I hope it doesn't cause that to lag like that. Okay, so walk a little bit. Save. Walk a little bit. Save. And literally, this is what I have to do because I can easily just jump off these bridges. Okay, I think I'm ready to turn and face the other hip blue. Because the bridge kind of makes a turn. Nope. Wasn't ready. See? I'm glad I didn't save there. Okay. See? Just a little bit. Oh! Save there. Okay. Okay. Okay, they're both dead. Now there's going to be a mad scrub shooting at me. Can I have your flower? Thank you very much. Okay, now there's a couple Deku, mad Deku scrubs around here. Now, <clears throat> I know the main platform is somewhere, but I... You basically go to all the DQ scrubs. I don't know if you have to, but that's what I end up doing anyway. So this one's easy. And then I fall right up to the right side of it. And then the left side. I'm surprised I didn't fall off there. Usually a spin will fall, make you fall off. Okay, where's your flower? There we go. Okay, now I gotta spin around and head towards the other one. Which maybe he'll let me know where he is. I'm gonna try here. Nowhere near him. Oh, but I heard a hip blew off to my right. So maybe I was too far to the left. Hit blue left. There he is. Okay, so I was a little too far to the right. So let's go this way. Save here. Okay. 
And this one has a little bridge that he's on. So... Ooh, that was close. Okay, steal his flower. So now this is going to get me to the main platform. I don't know if this is the most efficient way to get over there, but it's how I did it. So the hip blue is over there. I want to basically aim towards that, I think. And it's not going to be a big flight. Actually, I think I'll hear Tattle tell me when I get close to the middle. Right there. Okay, so now I'm on the main platform. All right, see? That's that. Okay, so this is as far as I want to get if I wanted to prog progress further in the game. But you know me. I want to overachieve her. So first, let's take care of this. And I have the song of soaring, so I'll be able to warp now. So, okay. We are going to go get us a piece of heart. So let's make two safe states so we're at this stage. And now we got to find another Deku flower. I think I think I'm almost found it. Oh, thanks. There we go. All right. I hear the next mad scrub we have to head to, and there's dragonflies. <laughs> okay. Yeah, that would have been a nice recovery curve, but... Yeah, let's adjust my shot so I'm a little facing toward him. And I didn't fall off, so I'll just take it. I wasted a bit of magic there, though. Okay, where's your flower? Why is my camera all weird? Ah, stay away from me! Got him. Okay. Oh, I hate dragonflies. I hate anything that stings. Urgh. Okay. Next. Deku Scrub, over there. We can ignore the hip blue because he's not going to get us where we need to go. Oh, that would have been cool the first time. Went for the bomb. Okay. Now, I think there's only one more Deku... Mad Deku scrub we have to get to. I know I keep saying it wrong. Sorry. Oh, thank you for the healing. I appreciate that. Okay. So, I know I have to turn around. Oh, there might actually be two more. Let's see. Okay. I don't know if this is the right platform or not. Nope, I think I have to go one more. Or how many more? Okay. Oh, see? I spin and I fall off sometimes. Okay. I think one more. I know I said that two ago, but I think literally there is one more. I think he's over here.
Thought he was that way. Where'd you go, buddy? There you are. Okay, so I need to go way to the right. And again, I don't know if this is the most efficient path to get over there. It's just what I figured out how to do. No mad scrub left behind. Alright, I think this is literally the platform where the chest is. Oh, let's not start by doing that. So let's see. Oh, but it's tiny. I think that's the chest. Let's see. Please be the chest. Yes! I thought I'd got it on the wand platform there for a sec, so I was searching around. Okay, so we got ourselves a piece of heart. And I think my hearts are showing again. And if I'm correct, and correct me if I'm wrong, but I just got another heart container because we got four more pieces of heart. So now what I want to do is actually I'm ready to enter the Woodfall Temple so what I want to do is actually reverse reverse time back to the first day warp back here and enter the temple ah. if I remember how to play the real song of time there we go so thank you for sticking me with the with me with through this guys I'm sorry this one took a little longer to get out but you stay with the uh, through the next uh, video and we will enter the Woodfall Temple. Thank you so much, guys.